since man first conquered space, he has set foot on many strange and wonderful worlds. Yet none stranger or more wonderful than one of the Earth's nearest neighbors, Venus. Venus, the water planet, its surface completely hidden from the prying eye of the telescope by a thick blanket of clouds. Venus, inhabited by a people as much at home in the water as on land, ruled by the young and beautiful Queen Vena, who, though handicapped by a weak heart, fought hard for peace among the planets. Only in peace can the planets of the galaxy prosper. Gentlemen, in the name of Venus, I renounce aggression. And so, for a few years, there was peace. But then... sending supplies and rescue equipment just as fast as humanly possible. Uranus is flooding, too. Five days of rain with no sign of it stopping. Dr. Zykoff, can this be a coincidence? Five days of rain on every planet in the galaxy. No. But I can't account for it any other way. Rain is a local phenomenon. Could there be some intelligence behind this? Who? And for that matter, why? What good does a flood do anyone? I don't know, but there must be a reason. Every planet in the galaxy wants aid. Every planet in the galaxy is in great danger of being completely flooded, inundated. Except Venus, which is already flooded. That's right. Only Venus is in no danger because its people can live in the water as easily as on the land. So naturally, Venus hasn't asked for aid. Well, why should they? Excess rainfall is no threat to them. Have they reported any unusual amount of rain? No more than usual. It's almost always raining there. Has it occurred to you that Venus might be causing this rain on the other planets through some remote atmospheric control device? You mean as a weapon of war? Gail, <laughs> well, you don't know the Queen of Venus. Queen Venus is the most peace-loving woman in the universe. <laughs> Is the Sky Flash loaded with emergency pumping equipment for Mars, Commander? All you can carry. You can leave as soon as you're ready. Good. Well, Dr. Zakoff, I've got an idea. Have you thought of analyzing this rainwater? What are you talking about? Analyze the rain. It may give us a clue. What kind of a clue? Well, I'm only guessing. But maybe your idea that this is an attack on the galaxy through some remote control atmospheric device isn't so far off. Even so, Flash... What can be unusual about rainwater? Finding that out's in your department, Doctor. But there is one thing that's unusual about it. What? There's too much of it. Queen Vina, no. You need practice, Drizzo. Control yourself. Put up your sword. You dare command me your queen? Forgive me, Your Highness. But if we are to succeed in our plan, you must be calm. I must be calm? I'm perfectly calm. It's you who tremble. Your Majesty. It's time to inspect the aquifer, Your Majesty. Yes, I know that can wait. At least until after you've recovered. <laughs>
walking on the water. Yeah, they say it's worse on Mars. Well, if it is, they'll be inundated in a little while. Let's hope that equipment we're bringing will at least slow the flooding. This rain doesn't stop soon. Nothing will help. Come on, Dale. Let's blast off. Right. Port thrust. Check. Starboard thrust. Check. Meter reading. Well, okay. Power. Okay, give me a time check. Minus nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, point. Planets are it will vary, Your Majesty. The smaller planets will flood long before the larger ones. Jupiter will be the last star. How long before Earth is deluged? Oh, eight days, maybe seven. Eight days? Why so long? Queen Venus, as we agree, we're trying to make this constant rain look natural. As you forced me to agree. Now I've changed my mind. I want this galaxy flooded as fast as it can be done. Your Majesty, do you want the planet governments looking for unnatural causes? Your galactic azimuth is Omega 9675. Set a course for an orbital pickup on Mars. Right. I'll get in touch with Commander Richards. Splash Gordon aboard Sky Flash 2 calling Commander Richards. This is Richards. Come in, Flash. We've set a course for Mars. We expect to make planet fall in two hours. Zarko here. Flash, you're not going to Mars. I analyzed the rainwater. You were right. The rainwater contains kaluminite, an element found only on Venus. You got that, deal? I'm setting a course for Venus. Queen Vena, I beg you, don't have the machine speed it up. You're a coward and a fool, Tristel. What does it matter now whether the planet government suspect unnatural causes? They're too busy fighting floods to fight us. Turn the amplifier to full power. Now the planet will really see rain. Venus in about 50 minutes. It's raining much harder. If this rain isn't stopped, everyone on Earth will drown. How much time have we got before it's all up? Less than a day. That isn't much time. You've got to hurry. I'll check back in about an hour after I've seen Queen Venus and found out what that she-devil's up to. I'm sure she's not responsible. It must be someone else. You know as well as I do that Queen Venus is the soul of peace. I'll give you ten days in the dungeons if you're not more careful. I need you more, my queen. Just get out of my sight. Your Majesty, a spaceship is landing. It looks like an Earth cruiser. One ship? Yes, Your Majesty. What shall we do? Do? Are you frightened by a single ship? Your Let it land. Your Majesty, I'm not certain it's advisable. I give the orders here. Let the ship land. Well, well, it's not raining here on Venus. Well, that figures that Venus is responsible for all the rain elsewhere. Come on, let's go. Right. Thank you. 
Majesty. As an agent of the GBI, I've come to ask your aid. I've heard of you, Flash Gordon. And what can Venus do to serve the GBI? You can tell us why all the other planets of this galaxy have been flooded with rain, containing columnite, an element found only on Venus. Yes. Yes, I can. I am responsible. But why? Because I, Venus, shall rule the galaxy once the rains of death have brought each planet to the brink of destruction. But you always stood for peace, Queen Venus. What made you change? Now I have no time to waste talking with you. Guards, take them out and get rid of them. torrential rains that are ever-increasing in strength threaten to flood the planets of the galaxy. Only Flash Gordon and Dale Arden know the rains are being caused by Xena, Queen of Venus. But Queen Vena has Flash and Dale trapped in her throne room on Venus. Majesty, wait. Why? GBI is trying to contact them. They know they've landed. They know they're here with you. What difference does it make what GBI knows? That was a good try, Gordon. That's the courage. Save them to the dungeons immediately. Silence. Come in, Flash Gordon. This is Dr. Zarko calling Flash Gordon. Come in. Life that he checked back long before now, Commander. I'm worried. If this rain keeps up, Earth will be drowned in a few hours. The answer must be on Venus. The answer's on Venus, all right, Commander. The question is, will Flash be able to find it in time? I need to help me rule this galaxy as a man, not a sniveling worm. I was the one who found you, who saw the resemblance, who made you the queen. I am the queen. Am I not, Crystal? Yes, Your Majesty. Take the girl to the dungeon. is not the queen. Are you sure? Yes. I've served the true Queen Lina for several years. I was constantly with her. 
my only friend, my sword. But it's not the warmest of friends. And Treesdale? Treesdale, babbling idiot. I need a man at my side. You could be that man. Thanks. I'm not in the market for thrones today. Besides, there's a question of Dale Arden. The woman on the throne is not my queen. Where is she now? I don't know. There is another cell that is being guarded. Perhaps Queen Lynn is there. We've got to find out. How can we get past the two guards? The one outside this cell and the one outside Queen Lynn's. We have no weapons. Oh, yes, we have. Here. Help me get this off. The girl dies. No, Venus. Not while I'm alive. That won't be for long. You're not Vina. How do you know that? The Queen was ill. A bad heart. Not a recommended cure for heart condition. God! God! Oh, my leg! Excuse me, but my ankle... they do to you? I don't know. I was taken from my bedchamber late at night and brought here. I don't understand. Why am I here? There isn't time to explain now, Queen Bina. Every planet in the galaxy is being inundated by rain. What remote atmospheric control device here on Venus could be causing it? The aquifer. Rescue facilities are in use. Yes, as soon as possible. Dale. Queen Venus. Yes. But who are you? I don't understand. There's no time to explain now, but we're your friends. Where is the aquifer? Down the corridor. Let me help you, Majesty. Any word from Flash? No. How long can we hold out? Minutes. Maybe half an hour. If the rain doesn't stop by then, we're doomed. Commander Richards calling Flash Gordon aboard the Sky Flash. Come in, Sky Flash. Yes, Your Majesty. Come here. You. You regret this. Without me, you're no queen. You'll destroy all I've done for you. All I will destroy, Tristo, is the harm you've done. Harm? Oh, out of nothing, I made you a queen. Masquerade is over. This is the real Queen Venus. Now, what are the guards out of the room, Tristo? Leave the room, all of you. Follow her. Come 
Is this where you turn it off? Oh, no, you Well, that's that. They won't bother you anymore, Queen Vina. I hope the Galactic Council will see to it that neither of them can endanger the security of the other planets. I promise you they'll never have another chance. What about the aquifer? Shall we destroy it? Oh, no, please don't. When my scientist designed it, its purpose was to supply rain to all the other planets when they needed it. Don't worry, it won't be destroyed. Used wisely, it can serve the galaxy well. Of course. Drought areas everywhere can be eliminated. Thanks to both of you, Venus can join all the other planets and try to make up for all the harm that was done. Only in peace can the planets of the galaxy prosper. The rains have stopped. Again, the planets can see the sun, the life source that all living things in the galaxy must see. This is the sun, one small star among the millions, the star of life. Yeah. 